Warning. The following program is rated TVMA and is intended for mature audiences. Warning. The following program contains adult material and language. So if you're a sensitive mother maybe you shouldn't watch it. Viewer discretion is advised. Static, you bastard! Static. In the heat of battle. When you're giving it your all. And you need to be your best. Damn, nigga, bad. Use John's butt cream. Oh, yeah. What I got next, son? Hey, Rob, man, see what's on TV, man. Oh, for show. Man, what did you do? Man, I didn't do nothing. Yo, man, look at the TV. Who got the hits? Who got the hit static? Comedy guaranteed, it's automatic. Professional hoodie, creating movie magic. One hit, one show, one plan, it's called static. Who got the hits? Who got the hits? Who could break it down? So ridiculous. It's one word, static, and professional hood. Our chronic comedy, and we give them the goods. We here to make you think, fall out, and just laugh. It's static, you bastard, so you do the math. We throwing it up, we know you gotta have it. One hit, one show, one plan, it's called static. Who got the hits, who got the hits, static? Comedy guaranteed, it's automatic. Professional hood, creating movie magic. One hit, one show, one plan, it's called static. <laughs> You bastard. Come theater. We'll be back after these messages. Hi. You've tried the Aggies diet. You've even tried the 47 hour diet. You tried the North Beach diet too, didn't you? And that didn't work. Well, guess what? We've got the diet for you, and it's called Two Baggin' Brothers. You can lose weight in no time. What the? They'll cap on your bones. Until you lose oh, some time. I'm like, buddy, get old out of here. Oh, Vicky, you. Well, your ass so fat it has its own zip code. What's your blood type? Chuckle? <laughs> Went to the zoo. Elephant said, what up, fam? <laughs> said you were discussing your bleed chicken grease, wouldn't you? Oh, Why does every call you get into become a low rider? So <laughs> big, couldn't even jump to a conclusion. Girl, you so big, people jog around you for exercise. Yes, big. Get on over here. You're just big. Mm -hmm. But you use the highway as a slip and slide, can't you? First they break down your self-esteem, and the weight goes with it. You make me really look like a goldfish. You so big you take a shower in a car wash. Girl, you so big you leave footprints in the concrete. You so fat when you fell down and you try to get back up and rock the same sleep. Girl, you so big you use a, a pool for a bathtub. Left the ring so big they call you Lord of the Rings. Eat your fat, you wake up in sections. Mm. Girl, you stepped in the elevator and went straight down. These are trained professionals in the art of bagging. Fat people go skinny dipping. Or do they go fat dipping? <laughs> fat dipping, I like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Got a cake there, girl. Results may vary. Very well hurt your feelings. Thanks, bagging brothers. Now just remember, next time you grab a bag of chips or trying to drive into a bucket of ice cream, this could be you. Mm, 
we got more jokes and you got rolls. Mm-hmm. Daddy, Daddy be coming Daddy. to you next. Mm-hmm. Gotta get ready for our next victim. Ball bitch, you. Let's go. So go get two bagging brothers today. And then you can start wearing whatever you want without being ridiculed. You fat bastard. Static. Hey, Kamisa. How's it going? Ugh, I'm so tired. I work like back-to-back shifts at the Flapjack house today, and my feet and my back are killing me. I know what you mean. I remember waiting on tables and having guys slap you on the ass and the corny birthday songs. I don't miss it one bit. They work you to death. That's why I'm so glad I changed my career. Now I love working. Girl, I can't just up and change careers. My whole entire family works at Flapjacks. My mama works there. My brother works there. My sister works there. My sister works at Booty Tap, too, but see, I don't know nothing about no gentlemen's clubs. Pancakes are my life. What is it you said you did again? I saw that fancy new ride you have over there. Pretty spiffy, huh? I went to Diamond College and received my certification to be a highly trained medical assistant with flexible hours and benefits. Now, I work at a really big hospital. You should try it, girl. I would love to, but see, honey, I got kids. And if I was just to up and quit flapjacks, what am I going to do about my bills? And mama. Mama would die if she knew I was trying to break family tradition. And my kids, no future if I just up and left flapjacks. No future at all. I guess it just beats flipping pancakes. Bitch, did you just disrespect me in my face? I- I'm sorry. You know what? I'm about tired of your uppity ass. Always thinking you better than me when you used to flip pancakes yourself. Well, uh, <laughs> I'm just saying. I didn't mean to offend you. I you just... know what? Ain't nothing changed. Ever since we were little, all you did is talk about me and my mama and them. But you know what? It's a new day. It is time for a change. And it is time for me to cut me a bitch. <laughs> Come out. Camisa, come out. Just chill out, okay? Camisa. I don't know you chill out. We gonna chill with this nice little bag. No! You know what? Ah! This is for all the minimum wage people that gotta put up with no clothes like you. You know what? What? Maybe Diamond College has a class called Advanced Pancake Flipping. <gasps> oh, bitch, bitch. You know what? I was gonna cut you, but now I got to kill you. Ah! Diamond College. Great careers and even greater rewards trying to share those opportunities with your less fortunate friends. Call today. Diamond Career College. It'll get you a great career, but it can't protect you from offending people, so call today. Girl, you so big people jog around you for exercise. Ooh, I bet you if you cut you, you bleed chicken grease. Why is every car you get into become a low rider? Static. <laughs> I said, what's up, my peoples? I said, what's up, my peoples? It's your boy, Grungy, about to show you how to live homelessly large. The show on the streets where our slogan is, if you ain't got shit, you can keep from living like shit. Yeah, boy. <laughs> Hell yeah. All scared roll. You know, we got to collect ride. I'm talking recyclables. That's our bread and butter, baby. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But that's how I eat sometimes. But you got that style of collecting cans and shit. 
So I got the hottest shit for you transients out there. Yeah, boy. Yeah. Look at this shit. Bam! Oh, shit. Look at this bad boy here. All the non-smoking tricks will be on you with this bad boy. Yeah, boy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Got custom black with chrome paint. Mm-hmm. Chrome billy grill with the symbol. Yeah, this thing has everything. Got two headlights. Look at them. They shining. Customized license plate for all y'all. You get the clue, son. Yeah. Eska not. <laughs> yeah. Satellite dish. It's ghetto TV, you bastard. You got to have this. Ha <laughs> ha, yeah. We got chrome, yes. No chrome. A custom 10 inch stereo box so you can hear the boom, 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 boom. Yeah. We got one TV on the side. I think that's about wow, six, seven inch. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, boy. That's what I'm talking about. We got one in the handle rest. We got a stereo. We got video game. We got a, oh, you got a car phone, holla, <laughs> yeah, yeah, boy. We got a, uh, the dish, the receiver, a DVD, MP3 player, so you can hear your tune while you collecting, you can listen and roll while you collecting, yeah. Also comes with a chrome digging stick, so you can be fly, that also matches that slur very interior, baby, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah. Look at the five inch custom rims with the custom spinners. Look at the motherfucking wheels. They be spinning. Yeah, boy. Spinning. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. This could be all yours, Pimper, for five dollars or five rocks. Whichever one you worth willing to give up, but it is worth losing a high over. So act now while demands are high, because it's hard still and all the shit to make these damn things. I'll get the number on the cart phone. It's 1-800-USE-ROCKS. Yeah, boy. So tune in next time when I show you how you don't need my nigra. Because psych medication make your dick stay hard, too. <laughs> yeah, boy. I said smokers out. I said smokers out. Yeah, baby. <laughs> yeah. You pick the hottest of a saw. Show you what? Are you tired of this? It's so easy for you to just go in the kitchen and Looking take out the trash. That's your job. Out. That's what why Well, we might just have the product for you. Like and this. it's called One, Nag Away. Two, How does it work, you say? Well, bathroom. it's like a hearing aid that why goes into your ear. But when it detects the high pitched tone of nagging, it turns the nagging into classical music. And you wonder, don't get why you are. It also comes in hip-hop. Even your favorite slow jams. All other genres of music are available. You should let Nagaway change your life. Why, why can't Thanks, you remember Nagaway. these things? I mean, it's simple little things like... Madonna. You can find Nagaway at Left Aid, Elmont, and Bullseyes. Prices may vary. <laughs> I'm Bishop Ed Bagans, and here at the Ed Bagans School of Ministry, we show you everything you need to know on how to run and operate your own church. Mm -hmm. See, because here at the Ed Bagans School of Ministry, our credo is M.O.B. That's not money over, you know what I mean? I'm talking about mind on Bible. Amen. Amen. Ah, see, in a few short weeks, we'll show you all the essentials you need in running your church right. Like, 
Name selection. Name selection is very important in running your church. You have to pick a name that's more than nine syllables. Count it. One, two, three, four. Nine syllables. Like Greta, Ebenezer, Faith of a Mustard Seed, Baptist Church of God in Christ. See, now that's 12 syllables right there. That's good. I need to write that one down. Wait a minute. Ah, later. And see, we teach you all these steps that will help you boost up your sermons, which will bring in more people, which brings in more tithes, which brings in more money. I mean, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Brings in more souls to be saved. Amen. Because at church, we're not about the money. No, not us. Mm -mm. We teach you techniques like coughing. He did it for you way over there. Yes, he did. He did it for all of us. Amen. He made our lives better. Amen. 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 Coughing emphasizes your words and makes your word that much stronger. Amen. Amen. Then there's profusious sweating. You got to feel it, cause he's in here. He is. Can I get a amen? Oh, y'all don't hear me preaching up in here. Can I get a amen? Can I get a amen? Oh, it's hot in here. Deacon Joe, turn on the AC. I'm about to burn up. It's so hot up in here. That's cause the sermon is hot. Cause see, if you sweat, that shows that you're hot. That your word is hot. And then they will believe that you're hot. And that's bringing them in. I like that. Amen, amen. Also, you have to know how to sing just a little bit. You have to know how to carry a note like, ha, ha, that works. Did it? Because we're all sinners. Amen. You a sinner. I know you sin. I seen you sin. I seen you. I seen you at the strip club with a dollar in your hand. Putting it in that crack. And I'm not talking about the white stuff. I'm talking about the booty. See, because when you sing, you get them involved, and then they start enjoying the sermon. Amen? Amen. Then, you also have to know your time. Because if you run too long, people get mad and they leave. Then you lose money. I mean members. And you don't want that to happen. So, you get your watch, and when it's three minutes to go, that's when you add in all these techniques to make the super sermon. Amen. Amen. That's right. And there's many more things I have to say about that. But, but uh, you see, uh, you got to be on his side. If you want the blessings to come down, the praises have to go up. Amen, church. You see, you got to be with him because uh, if you don't, uh, you're going to see, uh, you're going to see not him. You're going to see him. About glory. You got to, you got to move, you got to shake with them, you got to, you got to give them thanks every day, children, yes you do, I thank them every day, I thank them for my cars, I thank them for my house, I thank them for the G5 on 26s, yes I do, I thank them for all the fly women that I run into, yes I do, I just thank them every day, cause it's been good to me, I know it's been good to you, whew, and uh, whew. With that being said, I'm going to open the doors of the church. Come on down and get some bread. And those are the few things that we can teach you here at the Ed Began School of Ministry. So if you can, if you want to, if you want to start your church and you want to get people to come and you want to get all that money, I mean all them souls saved, then come on, give me a call, 1-800-ED-BAGANS. And we can get you into a class right away so you can start your church right away. Amen. Bring that collection plate over here. I need to count that last week's money. I said, what's up, my people? I said, what's up, my people? It's Ghetto TV, you bastards. You got to have this. <laughs> yeah. Yes, yes. Thank you, everybody, for watching Static. We love to thank you one more time. Amen, amen. I'm in Vegas. Give it up for the Static. Oh, they do it so well. Don't you agree? Yes, yes, yes. And right now, I'm going to bring out one of my boys, one of my favorite little boys. I remember him when he was young, when he used to steal from the collection plate. I used to 
smack him on his spot. But now, he's on the right side. He's on the west side. Give it up one time for A. King. When it's all, give it to what you ask for. Give him what they ask for, A. King. Give him what they ask for. Yeah. Ah. Come on, come on. Yeah, it's A. K. Smokers out. I said smokers out. Yeah, baby. <laughs>